Am I the asshole? For not bringing a cake to a wedding I was uninvited from? My ex-best friend got married this Saturday. I was supposed to be the maid of honor but she removed me from the wedding over a dispute regarding my makeup, hair, and disinterest in the wedding. She uninvited me from the wedding after I told friends my side of the story. I was responsible for the cake at the wedding, but canceled the order because I was uninvited and wanted to be reimbursed for all of my investments in this wedding. I told the bride I wasn't going to bring the cake over for them. The new maid of honor went to pick up the cake and learned that I had canceled the order. They were able to get another cake, but it apparently wasn't as nice. The bride, groom, and my sister who attended told me it was unfair to cancel the cake. My sister thinks I should have let them enjoy their special day and then later discussed getting my money back. The bride refers to the cake as a gift and claims that a gift cannot be returned. The groom just agrees with literally anything his precious wife says. Not the asshole. So they uninvite you from the wedding but believe they were still entitled to the cake you had paid for. They are all ridiculous if they think that is normal. Not the asshole. My sister thinks I should have let them enjoy their special day and then later discussed getting my money back. She's rather naive. The bride refers to the cake as a gift and claims that a gift cannot be returned. If an invitation can be withdrawn, a gift can be returned. You don't disinvite someone from a wedding and still expect a gift. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. You went from Mo to being told not to come. To me that means you don't have to give a gift and since you were ordering cake as a gift it then becomes bride and groom responsibility to order it and pay for it. I can't believe I actually have to say this, not the asshole. Why they assumed you'd still pay for a cake for a wedding you can't even attend baffles me. If they can take the time to uninvite you, they can take the time to book a new cake. You hadn't given it at that point, so it wasn't a gift. They uninvited you but thought they were still entitled to your gift. I'm afraid not. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. Amazing that they thought that you'd still pay for a cake after being kicked out of the whole wedding, how entitled can they be? Even if the cake was to be a gift, you don't expect gifts from people you excluded from your wedding. You can't take back what you never gave in the first place, and you informed them of your decision. Good on you. Not the asshole. Even if the cake was supposed to be a gift, you had every right to cancel it the moment you were uninvited. Not the asshole. You ordered the cake which typically requires a deposit. A deposit that came from your pocket. You were uninvited dropped either because you did try to make her wedding about you or she was being a bridezilla, either way you were under no obligation to foot any part of the bill. That was your money not hers. Not the asshole, I don't understand people who think they can do that shit and everyone is just supposed to accept it. Ungrateful bastards. Not the asshole. If you're not invited, you're not responsible for anything. Not the asshole. Even if they consider the cake a gift, gifts come from wedding guests. No guest, no gift. Not the asshole if they're going to treat you poorly, they shouldn't expect anything from you. Not the asshole. Letting the order stand and being paid back later is nice in theory, but considering there was just a major fallout here I think it's fair to assume there wasn't going to be an amicable return of costs to you. You were no longer responsible for wedding gifts or procedures since you were no longer involved in the wedding, and you gave them a heads up. It was their responsibility from that point forward. They could have immediately called and reordered the same cake to maintain the bakery's planned schedule, but didn't. You are not the asshole your sister very much is though. I can get her trying to stay friends with someone who has fallen out with her sibling. Their relationship is obviously separate to yours but she needs to not involve herself in things like this cake issue otherwise it becomes very much that she is not able to remain impartial in deciding with a friend. Your sister also needs to think about how your relationship with ex-best friend ended and seriously consider the fact that her relationship with her may very well head in the same direction. Not the asshole the bizarre nature of people who over the years have pissed all over the etiquette of a wedding marriage gets worse. Not the asshole. Very entitled to expect a gift if you had been uninvited. Your sister is delusional if she thinks your friend would have reimbursed you for the cake. Not the asshole. When she uninvited you and dismissed your duties, she should have gone over everything you were responsible for or had someone else do it, like the new mo. Not the asshole it sounds like when they said uninvited they meant demoted from guest to catering liaison. Not the asshole, you're no longer an invited guest. You're no longer required to give a gift, so you didn't. Sucks for her, but your sister not having your back is kinda messed up too. Not the asshole. She played a fun little game we all play, some people play it more often than others. 
It's called F around and find out. She found out. Ha, what? Bridezilla wants to uninvite you, but still wants you to give them a gift? There seems to be a lot more lurking below the surface here, but that alone makes them an asshole. Feels like not the asshole right now, but I have a feeling there is more to this story. Not the asshole. Are those people crazy? In which world do you remove someone's invitation and then act all surprised because you didn't get a gift? And the others agreed with them? Who raised them? I wanna know, I can't believe people could be this entitled, dear God. When I hear stuff like this is why I always politely decline invitations to weddings. This one thou takes the cake. I was supposed to be the maid of honor but she removed me from the wedding over a dispute regarding my makeup, hair, and disinterest in the wedding. She uninvited me from the wedding after I told friends my side of the story. More info please what was the dispute? Why did she accuse you of being disinterested in the wedding? What actually happened here? Ha 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 a bridezilla. Not the asshole. I don't think the cake counts as a gift, it's part of the wedding and part of your bridesmaid responsibility which she took off you. You're uninvited your gift is uninvited that's how she's looking at it? Smiley face. Either way not the asshole. Not the asshole. Especially since you gave them notice and they were able to get one. Weddings are high stress. Some people don't deal well. Hope you two settle up. Definitely not the asshole, you communicated in advance. INFO. Was the cake actually your gift or did you arrange another gift as well? How far in advance did you cancel the order and did any of the bridesmaids or the bride know? E.g. if you wanted to be reimbursed, did they know this and would it be a reasonable assumption that the cake cost was included? Generally I think NTA is you're uninvited from the whole wedding? But the timings could play into this. Not the asshole. It seems like almost everyone just goes batshit crazy when a wedding is being planned. But I don't blame you for not providing a cake free of charge when she uninvited you from the wedding. Not the asshole not even close lol. Not the asshole. Who cares what these people think anymore? Not the asshole, I have never known a guest, much less an uninvited one to be expected to order and pay for a cake for a wedding. It is their party. They could have ordered it and asked for it as a gift from you. But either way they should have been handling the affairs of their wedding. On a side note not sure if you were being petty or could have transferred the cake order to their name and not been responsible for it. If you had that choice or didn't even look into it that could make you petty and a little ASH. Not the asshole they wanted you to keep the order so you'd be forced to pay for it. Sounds like bride made a mess of a drama before her own wedding and she shouldn't have had the order in your name to begin with. Just from exactly the title says. Not the asshole. You were uninvited. So then your gift or any other contributions that are able to be refunded, cancelled, exchanged, store credited or whatever, is uninvited too. You can't expect someone to contribute to something they were not invited to. You being uninvited for whatever reason doesn't really have to do with anything because that's not what you asked. Not the asshole. It's Bridezilla alone who is DA. I find it so odd where people buy arranged things for other people's weddings, cakes, dresses, etc. where I'm from the bridegroom their parents maybe pay for arrange everything, the bridal party don't. Not the asshole, you told them you weren't supplying it, she should have checked and got something else sorted. Not the asshole, should have donated the cake to a local homeless shelter. Let them go and ask for it back from there. Not the asshole, she's right that it was a gift. The flaw in her logic is that she had not been given it yet. It was never hers. Added to add if you hadn't cancelled the order and instead asked for reimbursement, she probably would have continued to claim it was gift and that you shouldn't make her pay for it on those grounds. Not the asshole you don't uninvite someone but still expect a gift that's just taking advantage seems you're better off without this user in your life. Edit. After reading your comments it's ridiculous she claimed you was uninterested in the wedding when you saw her struggling and was the one who offered to arrange the cake so sounds she turned into a real bridezilla. Not the asshole why would you pay for and bring a cake to an event you were uninvited from? You even told her you weren't bringing the cake, the new mo should have checked with the place to make sure there was a cake. Yeah you totally should have paid for a cake as a gift for a wedding that you were uninvited to and aren't allowed to attend makes total sense. Not the asshole your sister is wrong if she thinks you would have been able to get that money back. If they uninvited their maid of honor which is already a rude move. Basically an f you kind of thing then who honestly thinks they would have refunded the money for the cake. Yes the day is special and supposed to be about them but you don't treat people like shit because of it. Sounds like a super entitled couple that gets off on power trips.
not the asshole. Not your responsibility if she relieved you or your duties. Not the asshole. Good for you. Gotta love it. We don't want you in the wedding and since you shared what a jerk I was being you can't even attend but you can pay for our cake. Not the asshole their expectations did not align with reality, lol no invitation, no gift. Do you would have gifted the cake had you been an attendee at the wedding. Not the asshole. The average wedding cake cost 350 bucks. No sane person would drop that kind of money for something they were uninvited to. I'm leaning NTA, but just need more info about the dispute to know for sure. It comes down to whether her makeup, hair, and interest in the wedding expectations were reasonable or not. But overall, if you're not invited, you don't give gifts. And good on you for cancelling. Not the asshole, you also informed them prior of the cancellation of the cake. That makes you a better person than I am, if I was uninvited and they made entitled comments like it's a gift no take back size, I wouldn't inform them about the lack of cake and they could enjoy their cakeless wedding. Not the asshole. Why is OP expected to not cancel the cake after she was uninvited? OP is not the ah, and anyone saying she is an ah is weird. Info when you say you told them you weren't bringing the cake over, did you clarify it was cancelled too? Or did you only say I won't bring the cake over? Not the asshole because you shouldn't have to pay anything after you get uninvited. I would have at least tried to get the new mo to reimburse me and telling her you'll cancel if she won't. That at least gives them the chance to make it less disruptive while still paying you back. Not the asshole. You maybe could have communicated better but I don't think I'm not invited so I'm not buying a kick is some extreme unbelievable stance. Bride should have prepared for and expected any investment on your part to be revoked, assuming anything else is dumb emo. It's like oh you're not allowed to come on vacation with me but you still owe me for half the trip. To hell with that.